page 36. We have some music at the bottom of the page. There's, it's kind of a little exercise thing, all right? It's not really a piece. Of, it's not. It's not a song, but I want to cover it because it's kind of important. Now they're talking about what they call the middle G B D F group. It's just the four notes that in the grand staff that are kind of in the middle around the middle C. That's fine. I'm not really interested, but I want to cover this music at the bottom of the page. All right, so I'd like to play that together with you. You're using those notes they talk about up above, all right? So let's just try this music at the bottom. It's in 2-4 time. I'm only going to give you two counts, so we're, we're just, because it's a little short thing, we're just going to do it. So the left hand is here, right hand is here. That's middle C position. Ready and go, Am. Two, off. Page 37, Mexican clapping song. They're introducing the accent marks little sideways arrows. Now don't get confused, the long arrows are crescendo and decrescendo, or diminuendo, get louder and get softer, but the little arrows just over individual notes like this, those are accents. They may play it with a little extra oomph. All right? Different kinds of accents. These accents, just a little extra oomph. Okay? You, there's others that give you more oomph. Don't worry about those. This is a little extra oomph. How much extra? I don't know. You figure it out. Just extra. Otherwise, there's nothing in this. You've had chord rest before. Uh, let's talk about the notes slightly. You're starting in here and here. Right. You have to figure out what all those chords are. Shouldn't be a problem. At the end, you're changing position. We've been in this position all along. Last two chords, you're changing it and you're going to put your fourth finger on the F, move the hand up, and on the right hand, instead of here, you're going to put two and one, one and two. So it's there. That's what they're suggesting. So just so you know, the hands move just a little bit for the last two chords is all. Give us three counts, let's try this out and see what happens. You already know the stems up and down tell you which hand to play which note, all right? Yeah, we've been through this before. One, ready, go. Rest. Rest, rest. Rest. Rest, rest. Rest, rest, rest. Rest, rest, rest. Oh. See, the piece doesn't end until after the last rest, by the way. Okay, just so you know. We went slow. This piece is supposed to go much quicker, and you can find recordings of them. I tell you, have fun with it. It's a fun piece.